If you want to use 3D art in your design, but you don't know how to use 3D software and you don't like using AI, then this is the video for you. What's going on everyone? My name is Tom from Dreadlabs and I'm a visual artist and graphic designer. And in this video, I wanted to showcase an asset pack of mine called Dread Renders Volume 5 Metamorphosis. This is an asset pack that I've been working on for some time and it's supposed to help graphic designers use 3D art without the need for any 3D software. So before I dive further into the pack, if you're not interested in getting it for yourself because it does cost money, later in the video, I will share some free resources to help you get started on this on your own. If you watch this video all the way through, you'll even get a free surprise. Think of this render pack as a stock photo bundle. Each render in the pack is a transparent, high quality PNG file ready to be used in your next artwork. Simply drag and drop it into Photoshop or any of your other preferred design software and start creating. So when I first started learning 3D, I encountered a problem. I wanted to create abstract chrome art and I knew how to create chrome materials, but I had no idea on how to create these abstract chrome sculptures. Luckily, nowadays I know how to do those and I do have a video on it if you want to create them for yourself in Cinema 4D. But if you do not want to create them yourself, the actual 3D files are also included in the asset pack for a couple of bucks extra. That way you can also drag and drop these sculptures in your favorite 3D software and create something cool with it. So if you made it this far in the video and you didn't click away, thank you for your patience. If you go to dreadlabs.net slash chrome, there's a free sample of the Dread Renders Volume 5 Metamorphosis waiting for you there. But don't tell anyone. So a few years back I did a live stream called Cinema 4D for Graphic Designers. And even though the version of Cinema 4D is old and I stutter a lot in that live stream, I think the information in there will really help you become a better designer in Cinema 4D. To create the abstract sculptures themselves, I recommend learning all about the volume builder. I have a separate video on that too. And I made it last year so there's a lot less stuttering than in that live stream. I also have tutorials on how to create chrome materials and iridescent materials too. Finally, there's of course the big problem. Cinema 4D costs money, so it's really nice that all of these videos are free, but the software isn't. Well, let me tell you, if you're still a student, you can get Cinema 4D for as low as 3 bucks for 6 months. And 6 months should be enough to let you learn a lot of the basics from the software. But if you need to buy the software offer and you're struggling to know how to pay for it, I also have a video on 5 ways that I make money using Cinema 4D. Which for me is luckily enough to cover the cost of the software. Now of course these free resources don't really match with the video title. That being said, if you watch this video all the way through, that means that you have at least one freebie to work with and see if this 3D design and chrome art is something for you. Thank you for watching this short video and I hope this was at least a little bit useful. If you have any specific tutorial requests in Cinema 4D or any other software such as Photoshop or Illustrator, let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and with all of that I want to thank you for watching this video. This is Tom from Dreadlabs tuning out and I'll hopefully see you guys in the next one.